Global Runner. Hi everyone, I'm the Global Runner and today we're going for a run on the island of Providenciales in Turks and Caicos. We've already done a couple of beach runs, so today we're going to focus on the interior of the island and see if we can find some of the towns. I'm going ultra light today, I've just got the action camera that I've got with me, no phone, no drone, nothing like that. And a pair of shorts with um, some water in the front and that's it. So lightweight, minimal, and uh, let's go and have some fun. So obviously there's the nice parts of the island, but I like to go and have a look at some of the towns, see if we can go and see the less uh, polished parts of the island. Just ran past the bus stop. The bus stops in Canada are fully enclosed and heated. This is uh, a very different situation here. Oh, that looks good. We've got a definite headwind. It's keeping me nice and cool. At least it's not like Canada where it freezes your eyes if it's too windy that. That's the Ritz Carlton behind me apparently. Maybe one day. This is a pirate island. So heads in the stocks. Got a cannon here and we've got Day of the Dead for a Mexican restaurant. And here's the pirate. In fact there's a few of them. We've got a woman climbing the rigging there. We've got a guy with one leg here. And we've got the kid over there looking out. I wonder what happens if you ring the bell. I'm not going to try because there's a sword next to it. And look at these flowers, like, we won't see flowers in Canada for another three months. All grass, I'm in a residential community. I'm quietly confident I should not be here, but security didn't stop me. So, my rule is, wait until you're stopped. <laughs> that doesn't obviously apply universally. We're four miles in and I stop for a drink. I'm going to go out a little bit further and then I'm going to explore some of these down here. But I do like the look of this road, so let's give it a go. So they're building my sidewalk there. Look, that's definitely for me. And they're not quite finished yet, although this looks hopeful. I've just seen there's some sort of marina over there. So I'm going to go and see if I can check that out in a minute. That was cool, I don't know if that's an update or something, but I just looked at my Apple Watch and it said, you've left your iPhone behind. It even tells you if you've forgotten your phone, which wasn't much help four and a half miles into my run, but still, it's the thought that counts. So, do I stay on this road or do I go on that road? That is brand new. I'm going to stay with the tried and tested for a bit. Okay, I'm at the end of that residential community. I don't want to leave in case they don't let me back in. So this will be my turnaround point. Just over four and a half miles in. Tailwind here 
which as I said on the way out makes it not really ideal for running in heat so the second half is going to be hot these shoes though I mean talk about horses for courses on the beach which they're not designed for they feel really cumbersome on the road they just let the miles tick over they are such a good shoe well here we are that was quick oh wow so best of you on that side on that house we get the Ritz Carlton and then if we cross the road Imagine this being your lawn. I think I could have my morning coffee on there. I just ran past the fancy part of the marina and they <laughs> definitely won't let me in. Didn't want to push it with the security guard who may well have been Dwayne Johnson. Serious boats here. Look at that one on the end. I think I'm getting shouted at. I'm going to have another drink and then get out of here. Those were some big dogs. Oh, this is a nice road. Again, I do believe I'm not supposed to be here, but maybe I'm gonna buy that. <laughs> Wish. Okay, I've done it again. Well, it doesn't say private property. It doesn't feel electric. Let's give it a go. My problem here is though, that I think I need to be that side of the marina. Yeah, okay. Yeah, this is not where I'm supposed to be. <laughs> Look at that house. I ran past a house with starfish on the like front gate bit. For some reason that really tickled my fancy. I'd love a house with starfish on the front gate. <laughs> Nina Lane, please have a bridge. Nina Lane, dead end. I wish I was staying there, but I'm not. was a good one but really hot I did have to run back to that first roundabout to get out of that residential area so that's all fine but my uh, phone gave up I don't know if it was overheated or if it ran out of batteries but either way I can sympathize <laughs> now time for a coffee 